so superheroes are real, not quite but kinda sort of. Some people can start a fire by channeling the electrical energy in their bodies. There are rich billionaire geniuses just waiting for a tragedy to become the villain. But nothing to the scale or imagining that the comics portray. That isn't to say they are any less amazing. And today we'll take a look at top 10 superheroes gadgets which actually exist. Before we begin make sure you hit that subscribe button to get notification every day for more amazing content. Real Life Dr. Octopus Suit Eric Finman, the world's youngest Bitcoin millionaire, recently made headlines for creating a real-life, functional version of Dr. Octopus' iconic forearm prosthesis for a young Marvel fan who also suffers from hypermobility symptoms. Finman, who got his start in cryptocurrency when he was only 12 by investing a $1,000 gift from his grandmother in Bitcoin is now worth around $3 million and is considered one of the world's most influential teenagers. But his most exciting venture yet has to be transforming a 10-year-old comics fan into a real-life version of Marvel villain Dr. Octopus with the help of an intriguing prosthesis. The design and manufacturing process took about 6 months. Still, the result was quite impressive. The unusual prosthesis featured four flexible tentacles controlled via rear-mounted microcontrollers and powered by a total of eight servo motors. Eric Finman believes that with further refinements and modifications, the suit will one day be able to lift up something as heavy as a car and have applications in various industries, like construction or the medical industry. The Pyro Fire Shooter the Pyro Fire Shooter lets you fulfill your Dragon Ball fantasies, where you play manga hero Goku and shoot fireballs from your open palm. For those comic book fans among you, it's basically as if Spider-Man shot fire from his wrists instead of webbing. The firing mechanism uses a paired remote control triggering each of the four shots you have in turn. There are no mechanical parts in the wrist cannon. Small heating element, powered batteries, at the end of each chamber light, when you press the button on the remote, and ignite the flash cotton. This in turn lights the flash paper as it fires it out of the barrel. Grab the remote control. There is only one button, it steps through the barrels in turn. Seven prototypes were made to develop the final model. Superhuman Exoskeleton the Iron Man style military kit is designed to make troops stronger and even more resilient in the heat of battle. The battery operated technology, called Onyx, uses a range of sensors and artificial intelligence to aid natural movement. Its job is to lighten the load for soldiers who are deployed into war zones bogged down by heavy but essential gear such as body armor, night vision goggles and radios. Altogether, that kit can weigh anywhere up to 64 kilograms, when the recommended limit for battle troops is just 23 kilograms. The battle skeleton is being built by Lockheed Martin, and was originally designed to help those with serious mobility problems. It also assists with crawling, walking long distances, walking with load, walking up or down hills, or carrying loads on stairs. Early tests of a previous version showed that the exoskeleton has increased productivity anywhere from 2 to a staggering 27 times. Real Life Predator Cloak The Predator is able to slaughter its human victims, except Arnie, thanks to a high-tech camouflage suit which lets it blend into its surroundings. Now the nightmare vision of an invisible murderer from space could come true on Earth, thanks to University of Bristol scientists. The researchers have created active back quote predator camouflage skin that can blend into different backgrounds by mimicking the way squid adapt to their surroundings. The artificial skin could be used to create stealth back quote cloaking suits which allows wearers to camouflage themselves. The tech cop is pigmented chromatophores, which are the cells on the skin of cephalopods like squid, octopus and cuttlefish. The cloaking suit could be used to blend into a variety of environments, such as in the wild. Backquota could also be used for signaling purposes, for example search and rescue operations when people who are in danger need to stand out. My Aware Bionic Claws We've seen plenty of Wolverine claw replicas, some even retract and deploy on command, but My Aware's claws react to your muscle movements. Now you can be the Wolverine you have always wanted to be. These claws sense when you flex your muscle and the 4 inch claws flick out in just a fraction of a second. 
then you can just relax your arm and the claws recede back into the glove. They may not be made of adamantium, but they are the coolest wolverine claws you can get. Myaware has even made their hardware technologies open source and shared their step-by-step -step instructions to build their claws for yourself. How cool is that? Their Kickstarter campaign will be donating one of the new 4th generation sensors for every 5 backers to Limbitless Solutions, a non-profit organization that builds and donates 3D printed myelectric prosthetic arms to children around the world. That's doubly awesome. Green Goblin Hoverboard A modern day Orville Wright has set a new world record for riding a hoverboard flying the device more than a mile over water in source at Lepins, France. Frankie Zapata's flyboard air is nothing like the popular commercial contraptions that don't actually hover, but simply roll on sidewalks before bursting into flame. And unlike models that trail hoses enabling them to fly via water propulsion, the flyboard air is propelled by air. It resembles the flying platform Norman Osborn, the Green Goblin, burst around on in Spider-Man. This version used 5 small jet engines and Zapata carried kerosene in a backpack. It has 1500 horsepower. The 22 mile crossing took 20 minutes and reached speeds of over 100 miles per hour. The flyboard costs about $250,000. They are not practical for most military purposes. However, there seems like there will be an extreme sports market and extreme racing competitions with both flyboards and jet suits. Jet suits have been made and combined with 3D printed titanium. These are the closest to a real life Iron Man or Titanium Man from the comics. Spider Man Gloves Prototype Spider Man gloves that will enable window cleaners to scale walls, robots to scurry across ceilings, and rock climbers to hang about could be ready within three years. There has been popular interest in how to mimic his extraordinary wall climbing ability since 1962, when the web-slinging hero with superhuman strength was born in the pages of Marvel Comics. Peter Parker managed the feat, after being bitten by a radioactive spider on a science class field trip. Now there is no need to be of an arachnid persuasion, but simply make like the gecko instead, given the lizard's uncanny ability to run up walls and across ceilings on its five-toed feet. A Californian team reports today that has got the hang of gecko adhesion and solved the mystery of how the lizards manage to stick without getting stuck, marking a boon for real life Peter Parkers. In tests, the 70 kilogram climber successfully scaled a 3.6 meters high vertical glass wall using 140 square centimeters silicone pads in each hand. However, the exact details of their climbing method remain classified. The agency's Z-Man program aims to develop biologically inspired climbing aids for soldiers without the need for ropes and ladders. It's the NK-01 This might look like something out of Marvel movie, but the massive exoskeleton is actually real. The prototype Metro Exosuit is a nod to the Robert Downey Jr. or Iron Man blockbusters as it's been put together by a team who are thrilled by comic books and cartoons. The NK-01 has been showcased in Beijing by its proud owners, Chinese tech company FutureWise. And much like Iron Man, the incredible invention can even be piloted by a person wearing the suit. The grey, silver, and black color scheme even echoes Iron Man's fellow suit wear a war machine. Although mechas like NK-01 are still in their prototype stage, FutureWise has set their sights on becoming the first company to commercially produce them. Don't get any Tony Stark ideas of fighting supervillains though. The firm has stated that the suits will be mainly entertainment performance products. Mind Controller Taking control of another person's body with your mind is something that has been long dreamed of in comic books and films like X-Men, but now scientists have achieved it in real life. Mind control is on the cutting edge of that technology with headgear that allows you to do things such as make a toy car whiz by or help a quadriplegic mix music like a DJ using just their brain power. It works by scanning your brain for signals using the emotive EEG device on your head. That device then relays your signals through a brain computer interface to detect emotions, interest and a slew of other things. Sarah Bademo's the most recent prototype of Emotive's new wireless neuro headset. Magneto Magnetic Shoes 
In backquote X-Men movie, supervillain Magneto is shown ripping a baseball stadium from its foundation and levitating it off the ground. Inspired by this incredible power, a plumber from Lincolnshire has attempted to recreate this metal controlling power using homemade magnetic shoes. Colin Furs spent a week creating the strange gadget, which allow him to walk upside down along metal ceilings. He could potentially use his mad invention to scale skyscrapers, instead of taking the lift. Mr. Furs built the magnet in the shoes using a microwave transformer, with one of the coils removed, and hooking it up to a car battery. He has attached straps to the shoes with switches which power the flow of electricity, and enable him to walk. He has now attached straps to the shoes with switches which power the flow of electricity, and enable him to walk. Thanks for watching, be sure to give us a thumbs up, if you enjoyed this video also don't forget to subscribe to always be in the top 10 videos world.